One of the new algorithms in Disting NT firmware 1.5 is the poly resonator. Um, the resonator has been there for a while. The resonator, as you will no doubt remember, is um, rings. It's rings. So the poly resonator is basically a whole bunch of rings. Now, rings itself has polyphony options. Uh, we're basically at divides down the modules processing internally uh, and shares it amongst voices, but you still only have one CV gate input and it's very much geared towards triggering one note at a time and just letting multiple notes ring out. Whereas this is basically like having a whole bunch of rings, one per voice. So in this case, I've got four. So I can actually play a chord. Or if I just play a four note chord. And it's basically as if I've got four rings modules in the rack, each one dedicated to producing the sound of one voice. Um, you know, and that's basically it. And then you've got shared control over the different ringsy things. Expect. Um, and being a polysynth on the ooh, a polysynth on the distinct NT, you've got all the stuff that you would expect, like uh, microtuning if you want to play your rings in just intonation, and you've got the uh, chord functions. So let's do. Well, what should we do? So. Um, all that kind of good stuff, and you can control it through polyphonic CV gate inputs, um, as well as MIDI like I'm doing here. So yeah, that's um, the poly resonator in firmware 1.5.